Hey, good morning. This is uh, show 10974 coming to you here in beautiful, sunny, and warm Walt Disney World here in Orlando, Florida. As you can see, we're still here. No one's blown away. Yay. Um, just giving a little update of what's going on. Give a little tap and go boom. There you go. You can see the sun is out, the birds are chirping, and all that happy go lucky stuff. So, what's been going on is that uh, Ian has moved by Orlando. We are kind of on in one of its major rain bands. Uh, it's moved to the east, uh, east northeast. Um, it's now moving. Um, Moving slowly towards the Atlantic side or the east coast of Florida. We're still expecting an extreme amount of rain in the area. We're under a flash flood watch, or actually, correction, flash flood warning here in the Orlando area until 1045 this morning. They're still expecting almost up to 18 inches of rain in the area. As you can see, the wind is. Uh, Blowing pretty good. Got up this morning a lot of some broken trees, some local ground flooding, things like that. But you know, overall, not not too too bad. Not too too bad. So we're just kind of chilling and waiting and stuff like that. You know, nothing not the big. But there's some uh, other news that came out of this whole entire wonderful story that. Um, not just for, not here, but Lee County over on the western part of the state, uh, where um, Ian made landfall, the uh, area of Fort Myers, Fort Myers Beach, Sanibel Island, um, Venice, things of that. Those, the uh, Lee County Sheriff has unfortunately, um, through ABC News, um, uh, reported hundreds of deaths. Um, and there was also just recently a story that just came out uh, from Daytona Beach on the East Coast that a 72-year-old gentleman uh, was killed when trying to drain his pool. Ran hose from his pool down to, I think, a river that was nearby, and he went down the bank. Um, so, yeah. That's what seems to be going on around here. Nothing... Now, no, nothing reported here in this area. Just a lot of wind, a lot of wet, some tree damage, you know, things like that. It's a wonderful, it's a wonderful 72 degrees and raining pretty good. The building held up with no problem. Slept through most of it, so yay us. So, yeah, well, the, the park still remained closed. Mm, no flights. Um, no flights out of here. The airports are closed. Um, at least, allegedly, it's supposed to be opening tomorrow. But as an update, you know, the chill zone will not be leaving Florida until at least Sunday. Yep, and then we'll be back in our home studios. So... We're hoping maybe once this passes, maybe they'll open the parks and stuff like that. We'll see what happens. We don't know. They'll keep us updated, and then I'll keep you updated. So I'm hoping that this finds everybody well and what have you. Um, oh, the other thing, I know I've been promising to put out more, uh, put in some more uh, reports and stuff like that. But for whatever reason, the Stream App, lab, the Streamlabs app was pu was putting things out